So, I'm pleased to say this edition here, which we're about to open, takes us up to 20 complete inbox Super Nintendo games. So yeah, so welcome back to uh, the Super Nintendo collection. So this is episode 8, and yeah, like I say, I'm... It's, it's going to be a really quick video, this one. Basically, I'll, I'll just want to open this one up. Um, but I thought I'd do it on the video. And that will bring the collection to 20 CIB games. So, it's absolutely incredible. I mean, I, I just love... I love collecting for these. Like I say, I didn't have this console when I was a kid growing up. Um, so, I just want to... I'm just going to highlight one. Um, I just thought I'd... Highlight one game from the collection, and then we'll just crack on and open this up. So the game that I've picked from this collection, um, that I have played a hell of a lot of, and the wife loves it as well, and so do the kids, and that is the Super Mario All-Stars. Okay, And I'm a mate. So this was the first CEX roulette that I've ever done. And um, yeah, it was incredible. I mean, the box was amazing, complete with the manual. Yeah, so couldn't com couldn't no complaints at all with that one. So yeah, that's kind of where it all started, and then since then, you know, go back and watch the previous episodes if this is your first time here, and um, yeah, you can see where we are. So this one, I'm going to open this one up, and yeah, then we'll just deduct it off the sheet, and this will be a really quick video. But basically, this was a game again, which. I remember playing as a kid on the Amiga, um, so another Amiga sort of game, and it was brilliant. I mean, it's a bit of a sort of strategy, a little bit different, um, really well packed. And um, yeah, sort of strategy game, but really, really good. And yeah, I'm looking forward to giving this a go. I personally think without playing this version. This, this might be a bit kind of naive of me, but I personally think the Amiga version will, would have been the better version um, for the simple reason of the sort of mouse element. Anyway, here we are. Box, not the best. But the game is Populous. Not the best condition. I kind of knew that. Because it was an eBay purchase. Um, £15, I believe it was. No, I'd have to double check. Either 15 or 20 somewhere around that. Um, actually, let me just have a look quick. So, yeah, I've just checked on the phone. It was actually £21.99. Um, so, £21.99. So, yeah, the game's called Populous. And... Um, it's a really good sort of strategy game. Um, yeah. So anyway, let's have a look inside. Let's have a look, shall we? And there we go. Seen better days, to be fair. Manual. A little bit battered up. The cart's okay. There's, you know, a good label on the front there. There's no fade. There's a little bit of fading on the back, but there's nothing. The front looks absolutely fine. So, yeah, you know, boxed and complete. That's what we're going for. So, yeah, happy with that. There it is again. Just to have a little... I mean, it's a little bit... Seen better days, but, you know, it was just... I just literally wanted to make a quick video just to showcase it so we can put it up on the shelf and it can be nice rounded off figure. Um, we're up to 20 now. So, yeah, that's brilliant. I mean, considering... I know I did that period off where I wasn't recording the videos, but we're still doing really well. And even if you take that £21 off the pot, um, we're still going to have a nice amount to start the sort of new season with. There you go. I've added Populous there to the sheet. Twenty-one ninety-nine. So that now takes us to £222.42. 
which is a brilliant still brilliant amount to start the new season with so that's kind of where we are 20 games all complete in box um super nintendo journey absolutely loving it gave it a little whirl today actually that's another little point i should point out i did get another console i did just buy a console only um I was not going to put it on the sheet because it was it was a sort of a separate thing. Because my console, it was fine, but it would kind of like every after about twenty minutes or so, I found it started playing up a little bit. Either the, the, the screen would go off, or um, you know it would sort of lose sound. It was like an AV connection. Uh, in some cases, it just wouldn't even you know nothing would come up on the screen. It would just be a blank screen altogether. So. I might have a little look at seeing if I can fix it. If not, I'm sure I'll make use of it. It'll come in nicely as a display piece somewhere anyway. So I bought, I just bought a console only um, a few days back. I think that was about, f I want to say 40 odd quid eBay again. So yeah, that, and that's great. That one's working fine. I was giving it a go today. I was playing a bit of um, Barkley, Shut Up and Jam. <laughs> it's not as good as uh, NBA Jam, but anyway. Anyway, so yeah, that's rounded it off. So Populous goes in the collection and I'll see you on the next one. Cheers.